Today, I'm going to show you how to charge your car at the Electrify America charging station. We're in a Hyundai Ioniq 5 right now. Charging with the EA stations are free for two years, so that's a good thing. Because as of now, the rate is about $57 to charge your car from 0 to 100 to drive 300 miles. But before you get the car to the charging station, you have to prepare the car. This is known as preconditioning because right now it's winter time and it is super cold. The batteries are kind of cold and they don't like it when you pump it up with super fast charging. How do we get the batteries prepared? Well, first you're going to tell the car that we're going to a charging station. Click on search and then jump to one of the charging stations. I already have mine in the history, so we're going to click it there. It's the 2129 Oregon Avenue. You can click on start guidance or it will automatically start. Now go ahead and drive to that location and the battery will be ready for fast charging in no time. Now just for fun, we're going to verify the batteries will be ready. So I'm actually using an OBD scanner and I'm using this app called Car Scanner. Once you connect it, go ahead and click on dashboard. This app has so much info and it's just overwhelming. But what we care for now is the battery heater. If you scroll to the second dashboard, you would see it. The value was around 60 degrees Fahrenheit. Once it hits 70 degree, you should see a little window that pops up that will say fast charging ready or something like that. And also in the battery icon on the lower left hand corner of the screen, it will change from a battery icon to a battery icon with a symbol on it. I forgot exactly what it looks like and I'm so sorry I forgot to take a picture of it. But you'll definitely see that's there ready for fast charging. Oh yeah, and before you get to that location, verify that there are available spots. So you can see right here at 2129 Oregon Avenue, there is one charging station available. And hopefully by the time we get there, it's still available. It's a shame there's only four available charging stations, but two of them are out of service. One is being used and one is available. So hopefully we get number four. So once you get there on location, go ahead and click on the charging station. We're in charging station number four. Go ahead and open up the battery cover. Also pull this plastic covering right here out. This will expose all of this terminal right here as well as this terminal right here. For fast charging, we're going to use everything. Go ahead and grab the handle and plug it in. Once it's fully seated in, you should hear a nice clunk sound. That means everything is locked and being held into position. Let's go back to the EA app. Whenever you're ready, go ahead and swipe it to start the charge. And that's basically it. Once you swipe to start charging, you'll see this info. It'll let you know how much has been charged how much has been delivered. And whenever you're ready, go ahead and click on Stop Charging. With the Hyundai deal that's going on right now, it'll let you charge up to 30 minutes for free. Myself, I'm in a plaza near the grocery store, so I'm going to go shopping. Setting up the timer is a good idea because you definitely don't want to get charged over the 30 minutes limit. And if for whatever reason the car is charged 100%, you definitely don't want to get charged for being there idling. I don't know what the rate is, but it's definitely there. All right, we're up to 86% now. I got all my groceries done. Charging time was about 26 minutes. All I have to do is tap on stop charging and then we're done. Once it's done, it will give you a summary. It will also email you a summary as well. All right, hopefully this video helps you on how to charge your car properly using the EA stations. I really appreciate you guys subscribing to my channel, liking this video, and thanks for watching.